The search is on for a stolen trailer in Harriman. The Harriman rug rugby team trailer was stolen from their training place at Copper Mountain Middle School. That's where news specialist Garner Mejia is tonight. And Garner, this is a state championship winning program, I understand. What does this mean for players? Yeah, Dan, good evening. And that's right, they're pretty great. In total, all three teams have won uh, about 12 state championships, so they know what they're doing. Right now, though, they have to try to figure out what to do, how to practice without any equipment. There were thousands of dollars worth of equipment stored in that trailer. This field has been a setting stage for some of Harriman Rugby's greatest moments and victories. Rugby is a heartfelt sport. Teens like Daxton McPeak have grown up in this program. Rugby, it's, it's oh, what's the saying? It's, it's a bunch of hooligans playing a man's sport. It's on this field that Daxton says he developed a sense of purpose. It's a game of respect. I think that's the greatest thing about it is that not only your team's a brotherhood, but the whole rugby community is one family. <laughs> that value system is something Coach Elvis Hansen hopes will translate off the field. The brotherhood's real, uh, but teaching young men how to, to be young men and to, to cope with life, you know, because life's hard, you know. But today there's uncertainty. A major part of the team's soul is missing. It's not just us, it's the whole Harriman community that's getting stolen from. The team's new trailer was snatched away early Friday morning. I was heartbroken. Sets of jerseys in there, cones, everything we need to, to make this thing work. Surveillance cameras captured a white, newer model SUV driving off with a trailer around 1.30 a.m. To me, it's just sad. It's. We're not funded by the school, like I said, so we have to pay for this all ourselves. That's the worst part. Rugby isn't a district-sanctioned sport, so the team has to finance itself. Ten years of people's efforts to help build this program and to, and to sacrifice and to, to get us to where we are uh, was just gone. Nevertheless, the team is up for a challenge. It's that, that mindset like, so what, you know? Let's just make it happen. They have a game coming up next week and they'll be ready for it. Well, you know, you gotta practice, get on with it. We'll figure that stuff out later. Now, if you've spotted that trailer again, it was taken from Copper Mountain Middle School here in Harriman. You're asked to contact the Harriman Police Department. There's also, you guys, a GoFundMe account set up to try to help the team raise funds to replace all of that equipment.